Abilene, Abilene, prettiest town that I've ever seen. Folks out there don't treat you mean in Abilene, by Abilene. Well, first of all, that's biblical. I don't know if y'all are aware of it or not, but I was in a church a while back, and a preacher asked me to sing it. And I said, well, Pastor, do you think it's appropriate to sing Abilene in church? He said, well, it's biblical. And I said, it is? And he said, yeah. He said, tonight when you're having your late night Bible study, or if you do that in the morning, check out Luke chapter 3, verse 1. It refers to Lysanias, the Tetrarch of Abilene. Back in the days when John the Baptist began his ministry. Anyone want to tell me that the capital of Abilene is Abila, and it's about 18 miles northwest of present-day Damascus, Syria. That's probably all the news you needed to know about <laughs> Abilene. <laughs> but anyway, this fellow from South Carolina called me up a couple years ago when something was happening all over the country. And he called me up, this was a couple summers ago, and he said, George, I got some new words to Abilene. And I said, well, how'd you do that? It's already been writ. And he said, well, you know, something's going on in this country and you need to hear these new words. And he sent them out to me. And he was right. They were very topical and very contemporary then. And I think it's starting to become topical and contemporary all over again. So here's some new words to an old melody from Scott Thoen of South Carolina. Gasoline, gasoline, highest prices that I've ever seen. What on earth is going on with gasoline? Oh, gasoline. Fill my tank the other night. Watch that meter just spin out of sight. Don't I wish they would lower the price of gasoline? Oh, gasoline. What do you think about it, boys? There they are. How about a hand for the fiddle man? Any fun? From my home state of North Carolina, Jimmy Gabs. I believe you too. are great, but to see full episodes, go to CountryRoadTV.com. 